Good morning, everyone. Good morning. Good morning. Hey, this is officially take three. Yeah, but it's okay. The other video was really, really good. We just didn't record it. Um, have, but... you ever, have you ever recorded a long video and not hit record? Yeah. We have. But we're back on. Um, this morning we went to a French bakery and we got like some croissant sandwiches and some coffee and um, cool coffee cups. Yep. Yep. Fresh guys tea. Which is good, and um, we're in a 2019 ES350 F Sport, which is super comfortable. Um, what's the topic today? It's Bla Black Friday yeah. sales. Ooh. Black what Friday sales. Yeah. Have you ever been to one? Anyone in this car? Yes. Oh, yes. yes. Oh, yes. So Amanda and I have a, a story that is like on opposite ends. It's the same story, but just different perspectives. Yeah. So Amanda used to get up with her mom at 6 a.m., to go Black Friday shopping at the Fashion Show Mall. We would. And guess who was working at the Fashion Show Mall at 6 a.m.? Dominic. That was me. Yeah. My prior life. Yeah. So she got the enjoyment of running around, tearing apart racks, and getting these big sales. And I was the guy ringing them up, which yep. is a whole different experience. He was selling. I was spending. Yep. So um, <laughs> it was an interesting situation. But I, I myself... Um, loathe Black Friday because that just meant a lot, a lot, a lot of work. So be really yeah. nice to the people that are working Black Friday. That would be my message to you. Yeah, it's crazy. If you're Black Friday shopping, be super nice to them because it is a super long day and is kind of painful for them. That's true. Uh, Brooks, true. Well, you got a story, Brooks, right? You, yeah. yeah. You don't like Black Friday? He's not Friday? a shopper. Uh, I'm not a shopper to, to begin with, mm. but uh, I went to, to a store one Black Friday, I was in college, I was trying to get this TV, it was, I think it was 35% off or something, and uh, I saw a fight break out right in front of me over those TVs, so I just walked away and never never went Black Friday shopping again. Yeah, it's so, a lot. You either love it or you don't. <laughs> yeah. Bryce puts a helmet on and a uniform. And yeah, like, and like he gets a tent and a sleeping yeah, bag ready. and everything. Yeah, we go, we used to, me and my friend and his uh, parents, she used to give us a list and doors were open and we would run through the store pick up everything oh, i wouldn't say we would fight but like we'll pull it from someone else or but uh those are the old days i'm done that was I'm last year that was last year yeah maybe last year. maybe, <laughs> maybe this year is the last year but um so yeah, if anybody needs an xbox or a yeah. playstation you want to you know i'll do it for Bryce us. can do that for you yeah. <laughs> that's funny so the moral of the story is, is we'll be Ready to go 9 a.m. on Black Friday to assist you with all your new and used car well, microphones are falling. But we got a good selection of cars, new and pre-owned, which is really, really good. Yep. So you can come check those out. And also, did you want to talk about the toy drive that we're having? Yep. So if you're coming to shop on Black Friday or any time in between, we are hosting the toy drive that you've um, seen us mention before. And it is important that we take care of our, um, our youth in yeah. Southern Nevada. So Lexus of Henderson, Lexus of Las Vegas are uh, collecting unwrapped toys, boys and girls, ages 5 to 17. So, so nice. let's take care of our, our neighbors. Yes. Um, if you can bring an unwrapped toy, we'd really appreciate it. We're all participating. Yep. We need you too as well. So we'll see you at the dealership with that unwrapped toy. Yep, and we hope to um, that you and your family have a safe and happy Thanksgiving, yep. holiday, whatever you guys celebrate. And we hope to see you really, really soon. Have a great